What is wrong in saying that a first lady added weight while the masses are suffering? Here, Bossa Owagiarin asks. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. Here, Bossa Owagiarin, editor of This Day and Nation's Capital, spoken concerning the alleged disappearance of Amina Mohammed after his viral tweet regarding this first lady speaking on EIT News. Here, Bossa questioned what could be wrong with such action. Addressing the topic, Iobusa said, I saw a picture yesterday and believed she had added weight. Maybe she has been enjoying herself. I don't think that anything is wrong with that statement as some people would have read it and moved on. What is wrong with saying that the first lady has added weight while the masses suffer? I wonder what is wrong with that statement. He continued, some people would have seen that there is nothing serious about that statement that would warrant the alleged arrest. You may have heard that the National Association of Nigerian Students, Nancy Namini Press, apologized to Aisha Buhari over his tweet. However, the allegation has since stirred mixed reactions among Nigeria. Now, maybe she's angry that that is not the case. Maybe she's ill because nobody all waits within the ad be good, evidence of good living. Let me tell people the truth. Say, person swell up, get body. Uh -huh. Yes, yeah, so. Obes uh, um, I did, did I just say obesity? No, being a little bit plumpy does not mean every, um, you enjoy yourself. Yeah, people will be saying, men say they even get sickness for body. Maybe that's annoyance, but to me, I still say there is absolutely nothing that would around that particular young man being arrested. He should not be arrested. If you ask me, it's not that serious. It's not that... Uh -uh. If you look, the statement go up, look and down. It's not that serious. There are people in the past that have even said something that is more, you know, more brutal. They have been more brutal in their critics. And they're criticizing, you know, those in power. So what now is the problem? And sincerely, I mean, I was even thinking initially, I'm of the opinion that, see, oh, it could it be that the first lady is not the one that said this? As in, is not the one that raised this alarm? You understand? Could it be... Because I'm like, I shall worry. I still the reason the thing on the matter. I still the reason now. Could it be she's not the one? You know, I don't really know Shab, but the thing is, whether she's the one or not, she does not, this does not even, she's not, so, it's not even supposed to be up for discussion. It's something that you just sweep under the carpet and move on, if you ask me. Either ways, by feeding on poor people's money, you can say that to PMB, but not who is not holding a public office. Let us give little respect to our senior citizens. If this boy were to be in North Korea, he sure will not say this to NK for study. Eh, uh, look, let me tell you. All this one you are saying, if this boy were to be in North Korea, are they respecting us as Nigerians? They gave us the first insult. This administration gave us the first insult ever when they came in and said Nigerian youth are lazy. And they did not just say it, it became something known international. Do you know what it meant? Do you know what it means for your president to come and say that the youth are lazy? See, if you don't have any arguments, step out. There is nothing insulting here. Is this not good here? Are they even fulfilling their promises to us? Do they respect their oath in office? I beg, you don't even get me started. <laughs> Respecting those in senior citizens. They are going to get respect is earned. You earn respect. You don't demand it. This is not the 19th, the 19th or, or the 18th. And we are in the 21st century. I'm not saying it is good for results, but I find I don't find anything wrong with this statement. I don't find anything wrong with it. How do you respect those that are raping and looting our future? Why is North Korea as an example and not US who may copy the Democrats? Don't mind the don't mind them. Using North Korea to, to, to talk about Nigeria. Abagi. There is absolutely nothing wrong with that comment. How many times have presidents have President Macron been slapped by the public without ordering any arrest? Let's get it right now. Okay. Okay, do not be economic with the truth. The lad said the first lady has been feeding fat, feeding fat with poor people's money. Why are you the statement? The lad needs to be charged in court of law for character assassination. This will teach others on social media a good lesson. What is something that you talk about? Super story. Super story. If you don't want critics, please go and live in a cave. This is what I'm going to say. If you are coming out to work in public office, why I'm saying this is that I'm not, mind you, I'm not supporting criticism or I'm not supporting this kind of thing. But the thing is, 
this boy issue is like somebody slaps you then you shot the person that's what it means or somebody stepped on you then you shot the person say you stepped on me that is what the offense is does not warrant it and it is something he, she, 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 he could have, you know, she could have even, you guys see what is re, um, reply to this particular post. Eh? The boy will even apologize to her and say, okay, take the post down. It is not, it is not, called this life, nothing there. Yeah. You are coming to flex muscle on top of a small boy. Flex muscle with the people who want to flex muscle with you. Yes, now. Flex the muscle with people. Then the, the government, I'm so sorry to say, then be a buyer. Yes. Flex muzzle with people who have the capacity to flex muzzle with you. Don't come and be flexing muzzle with them, with the electorate. When you come outside for power, when nothing they do you, when nothing, as in, you know, if we see ourselves for a big fit, uh -huh, that kind of setting is okay. This um, battle now, or should I call it fight, is not, is not fair. It's not fair at all. Okay. Somebody is saying, actually, you are one of the problems of this country. I'm telling you. Of a church, she, did she not add with? Help me and ask, so, is this Aisha we used to know? No. It is only executive recklessness that she is using, and our police do not even serve the people, but there is no authority. Did someone not physically slap President Emmanuel Macron of France? Shame to the so-called first lady. See, now, now she will even get the real critics. If she think she, okay, she should come and start picking people who are making the statements. Yes, now, because to me, it doesn't make sense. And I hope this opened the eyes of a Northerners. A lot of people who are coming out to condemn this act now. They are not Northerners so. If Northerners like when they sit down, they sleep on top bicycle. Bicycle will be said they fight on the fleet. Huh. Okay. Is it a crime to add with in Nigeria or is she the only one that added with the accused of feeding on poor people's money? Are you trying to tell us that the first lady did not eat out of her money since they are into power? Or can you swear with your life that you are not taking what does not belong to you in this human life before? Let me faithful and fear God because it's the maker of all souls. I don't see the correlation here. Now, I keep saying it that this matter, you know, you know too deep. You know, supposed to be like this. What of patient good luck that was used for comedy skits, even till today? Why haven't she declared what to everyone? Now, wow, oh God, because Jennifer has no blue blood in her vein. And or the husband was not the president. Meaning what? <laughs> if I become president, I'll prove Aisha for the added weight at the time of unparalleled suffering in the country. <laughs> <laughs> you are hypocrites. Everything was wrong. Leave the first lady issue first. Is she his mate? <laughs> ah, wow. I guess some people say they enter power. Now they say, if you they take note of such citizens, so if power gets to their hands, you ever don't gas for a lot of people. Nigerians may not take note. This issue, let this boy be released so he can even go and prepare for his exam. It's not going to be right, Seth. It's not right that he stays there and, you know, the exam go come, go. He says, no, no, I beg. Make them release this man. Make him go. Make him go. You know, the government will not help him. Let him help himself. Write his exams. Continue with his life. This is actually not fair. This is not fair. Okay, on those notes, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.